week. Uh, we have three really cool matches to start off before the pay-per-view. The first one is an IG match of two veterans, um, and both are on different factions this year. That is Brandon the Hitman Hannah for the stars and Eric the Z-Man Zipper for swag. Uh, that we need some new Wednesday. pictures for those guys. I know. <laughs> that is on Wednesday. Um, and so, Jill, I'll start with you. Thoughts on Hannah Zipper IG match. Um, what are you thinking? I'm so excited for this match because I feel like every time we see Brandon and Zipper, they just get better and better every single mm -hmm. time we see them. And character wise, Hitman can go fall in a ditch. Um, but, but I, I love, love Hitman. Brandon. I love Brandon Hannah, and I'm I love Eric Zipper. I'm really good friends with both of them. And is does it is Ralph is Ralph going to be there? Is the question? I Probably would like not for the Hitman, but Chuck's taking Ralph. So yeah, can we pick Ralph? Ralph just surprises everyone and just takes the win. Um, I need I need to see who's on if I have them on my fantasy team. I think for me on this one, I'm gonna give the edge to Eric Zipper, especially because now with being on Swag, he has all those heavy hitting IG people in his corner. Um, so with. <laughs> I just saw Brandy's tweet. It says confirmed on Schmodown POV by FCL Commissioner Brad Gilmore. The FCL will be a fight to the death. Yep. <laughs> she tweeted it. She tweeted it the second it happened. It's the oh, game. that's yeah. good. Um, I love so, it. So because of the factions that they are on, I am going to give this light edge to Zipper on this one. Um, but I'm so, I'm stoked for this match. I'm excited to see Hitman again. Although I always give the character a whole bunch of crap on this show, it is a great character because everyone hates him. So he's doing something right. So, yeah, I'm going to give the edge to Zip in this one. Brian? I love both of them. These these two, uh, you've got the nicest guy trying to be the meanest person. <laughs> and then... And then I'm a shill for Eric Zipper. So it's We're like. We're all shills for Eric Zipper. I know. I I mean, yeah. I, I, I'm, this was, this is one of those ones where I don't care who wins. I just hope it's good. Um, yeah. I, I, I'm like 5149 Zipper. Like I, I just, I. I love Zipper. He cracks me up. He's too funny. So, although unless one of them is on my fantasy team, then I'm gonna go that way. But uh, I don't think any of them are on mine. No, they're not on mine. So I can go with whoever I want. I think I'm gonna go with Zipper on this one. Yeah, yeah but it's, it's gonna be close. That's it's it's tough. It's really really tough. I really do enjoy both of them. Um, I also like where they are this season as far as factions go. Me too. Um. Uh, Zipper obviously fits That's best in the dungeon, point. right? Uh, Zipper point. fits really well in the dungeon, which is where he was last year, but mm -hmm. um, or the past two years, I should say. Um, but he, I feel like he needed something to kind of just put him over that that little speed bump that he's been having. And he's only been an IG so long. He's only been an IG player for so long. And I think Winston might help him there. I really do. Obviously, Chandru is there as well, uh, which is which is big. And even even all the craziness that's happening with Chandru right now and and trying to go bad and stuff like that and, and get Winston out. Um, they're still going to help teammates, I would imagine. Uh, and that that's big for, for Zipper. On the flip side, Brandon Hanna might be the in the best situation he's ever had as a player. Um, you know, Roxy might not be the inner geekdom goddess of, of, you know, quizzing or studying or whatever, but she is one of the best managers, period. Yeah. Um, she is. And he also has a, an incredible amount of great players at his disposal to help him studying. Alex Damon, Zach Burkett, um, Janine the Machine. There's a lot of players on that faction that know IG movies very, very well. Um, and that could be very good for Brandon Hanna. Uh, I'm going to go 51-49 Brandon Hanna. I think Hanna might be on... I think that he this might be his best year yet. I really do. I think that he might be in a situation where it's going to be his best year yet. I also really, really want to see Saul versus Brandon Hanna again. Me too. I, I really want to see that. And for that to happen, 
Brandon Hanna has to win. Um, I'm very curious to see how Brandon and Roxy interact with each other. That's what I can't wait yeah. for. Yeah. I, th I think their characters together are going to be very interesting. Well, so. and Ro Roxy's not going to take anything from anybody. And, and yeah. Brandon, what, is, yeah. what has he done to people? He's given everything to everyone. So, uh, uh, yeah. So I'm curious as to how he's going to react to her. Because obviously she's not going to take his ish. So mm. she's going to just clap right back. So I'm very curious to see how the hitman is going to take that. Absolutely. Yeah. And for anyone that cares, this is a uh, Molly versus Dwayne match. Ooh. They both need it. They both need it. So, because um, <laughs> you're in, you're in first. I point. have two points. I think most. <laughs> it's a long season, guys. It's a long season. Um,